Silage is a type of animal feed made from fermented fodder crops. Making it requires planning because silage crops must be planted at the onset of rains. The crops are then harvested before the dry season, stockpiled and stored in an airtight pit until needed. Maize is a good crop for silage because it is nutritious and high in protein, which cows need to produce milk. When digging a silage pit, choose a location away from your animals so they do not injure themselves by falling into it. A smaller, narrower pit is easier to manage. For this reason, we recommend digging a pit two meters wide and one meter deep. The length depends on your desired volume. Please refer to fact sheet F01D for instructions on how to calculate this volume. Your silage can also be piled up to half a meter above the ground. After harvesting and chopping your maize and adding it to your pit, you will need to use something heavy to compact the material. Cover the pit with heavy duty plastic or sacks and put odd car tires or anything heavy material on top to keep the plastic in close contact with the silage. This avoids exposure to air which can spoil the silage. Your pit can be opened after six weeks. However, only open it when you really need to. That is, when other feed options are exhausted. After opening your pit, check for gray spots of mouth or rotting material. Never feed bad silage to your animals. If your silage is hot, that means it is changing into compost. Dig it out and dispose of it immediately. Use any remaining cooler silage as quickly as possible. Once a pit is opened, take care to prevent air, water, sunlight, soil, or dirt from entering the opening. Only open the plastic when removing silage. Do this right before feeding time so the material is fresh for your animals. Replace the plastic as soon as you've removed your required amount of silage. For measuring purposes, a 50 kilograms bag contains about 20 to 25 kilograms of green maize silage, which is how much a dairy cow should eat per day. Cows may not like silage at first because it is a new taste and texture. If your cows are reluctant to eat silage, check whether it is of good quality. Good silage smells slightly sweet, has a light brown color, and a slightly sour taste. It should be slightly moist, but not too wet. If your silage is okay, mix it with other feeds that you know your animals already like, such as maize bran or carpentan sofu. If your cow stew doesn't like eating it, secure it in the crow with maize silage and dairy meal only. Do not let it graze on maize tovers. It will give up its protest and start eating soon enough. Use a feeding trough to avoid feed wastage. For a dairy farmer, silage is a crucial food reserved so you can receive milk from your animals year round. Without appropriate nutrition, your dairy cows will produce little or no milk in the dry season. Silage can also be made in drums or bags. For more information on this subject, see fact sheets F01D and F01C.